Okay. All right, here's the wing I'm working on. It's the right wing, and I've got the aileron just about finished. Got to add a little balsa, piece of balsa in there for the control horn. But I'm gonna do that when I mount the servo right in here. Cause I'm gonna do that working from the top, not the, or from the bottom, not the top. But there it is. I still got to I still got to trim this out right here. Trim this down. I got to glue the the um, rounding edge on together. But I'm just kind of waiting on that until I get the wing finished. And I'm just about finished. I got that that little piece right under the under all that uh, my uh, official weights there. There's the glue mess. There's the there's the wing plan. It's just not very. It's just not very detailed I'm telling you that right now but um yeah as soon as uh, this piece dries here that piece dries there and under that dries I'm using a combination of uh, tight bond and uh, medium and thin CA but as soon as that dries we'll flip it over and we'll do it and then I'll, I'll trim I gotta I gotta trim this down this is what's kind of hard right here. That's got to be trimmed down to a quarter inch. A quarter inch. So I got to trim all this down. If I'd have known that, you know, if I'd have read the plans before I, st I mean, I read it, but I just, I guess I just didn't understand it. So I'm going to have to sand all that down there very gently. But as soon as, it, as, soon as this, this part dries, I'm going to flip it over and see it, see it from the bottom of the wing and stuff. And, uh, I don't know. I'm doing it. I don't. I don't know. I don't know if it's going to work. I don't know what it's going to. You know, as long as it, from what I learned, just putting that little um, twenty kit together. That as long as it's strong and semi-square, flat, like not warped, it's it'll fly. <clears throat> I finished this wing. I've got it all capped. I've got the elevator or the aileron capped. I've got the wing. I've done a rough sanding. Rough sanding. Got it all capped, sheeted, top and bottom. Uh, yeah, it was interesting. It's going to be interesting. Uh, I still have. I've shaped, sort of shaped the front, the leading edge, but I'm going to wait to shape it once I get both half. When I get all the wing, the joiner, the joiner, and the other wing built. Uh, big issue on this, uh, not really. Like I, I laid this out, these two formers here, I laid them out on the plans, and they were just a little bit wider with what I think was the stripping they provided, but I don't know. And then Lucy ate a, <laughs> she ate, a, she ate a stick of balsa. So I don't know what that that was yet, but um, I don't know. It's it feels nice and sturdy. It feels feels nice and light. Went well. Um, on this sheeting on the top right here, since it's curved, what I did is I put the um, the glue. I used tight bond, tight bond. I put tight bond on where it goes. And then let it dry, and then I got out my covering iron and ironed it on. It worked great. It worked absolutely wonderful. I did that. I did that with both sides of the front leading edge. It worked great. I turned turned the, the iron up pretty hot, and I kind of drug it along. This is the first side I did. You can see where there's a little bit of glue that got burnt. But there's no glue stuck to my, my covering iron or anything, and it worked great. All right, that's it. Um, I'll probably, next update I'll do is probably when I get the, the wing together, both, both, both half of the wings and the joiner. I just wanted to give a quick update on the SIG build. Thanks for watching. Thank you for subscribing and becoming part of Team Let's Go Flying. Woohoo!